Well today I'm going to show you how to do a coolant flush on a Volvo 940 which is like the 740s, which is also like the 240s because they share the same engine except this one's a turbocharged engine So first things first, I've been doing some other work to this thing, like the timing belt, so I already took off the fan I have little things, you don't need to do that, but um, so to do the coolant flush, what you start out doing is you take out the thermostat housing, which is two 10 millimeter bolt, 10 millimeter nuts. And yeah, this guy's seen some shit. And I take the upper radiator hose out. So that does the initial kind of a flush on it. I did take out the coolant bottle to clean it, but um, yeah. So. This guy is also, the transmission cooler has been modified, so that's why it's all like that. So, there is a drain port on the block in the back by the oil, oil filter. So, to get to that though, you're going to have to jack up your car. So, on the turbo cars, there's a lot tighter of a fit. Um, you need a 19mm socket. And here we go. Give me a second. Yeah, there we go. It is connected to there. That drain valve you see right there. That's the one you're looking for. And on the turbo cars, it's right by the oil filter, so be kind of hard to miss from the bottom side. So you don't have to take this valve all the way out. All you have to do is loosen it and then the coolant will start start coming out of there and then put your bucket on the bucket or pan or whatever down accordingly so I'm gonna go ahead and loosen it except I can't do that with one hand so we'll get back with you soon the other ones I've encountered this one I had to take completely out because it is clogged with crap but yeah I got that out, it was, it was completely filled with gunk. Because this coolant was probably not changed correctly. It's kinda, it's kinda gross. So, from this point, all you have to do is get your hose and then run it into the thermostat housing. It's hard to do with. Well, you'll find a way, but... There we go. So... You're basically just at this point just flushing water through the block and wait for it to come out clean. That's all you gotta do. It's good to flush it through there and also flush it through the uh, coolant tank which you just put on. So yeah, once you're done with this, reinstall the, uh, reinstall the thermostat and fill your system up, bleed it, and you'll be good to go.